Hello friends, welcome to our YouTube channel SSC Selector. In this video, there is a triangle ABC and there are three lines drawn from A, B and C. The lines are AF, B, D and C, which meets at D, E and F. And the ratio of the side intersected by D, E and F are given. This is one is to one. This is 2 is to 1 and this is 3 is to 1. And we have to find out the area of DEF and area of BC ratio. Ratio of area of DEF and area of A, B and C. So let us start how we can solve this question. Before I give the explanation of this question, let us understand a property of triangle. If in triangle A, B, C, the base is intersected in the ratio of x is to y, then area of ABD and area of CD, ACD will also be x is to y in the ratio of the base. The reason is area of ABD is half base into height. Let us draw the height here, h. So it is half base is BD, height is H. Area of ACD is half, base is CD. And if we take the base as CD, height is H. Same height, an obtuse triangle, obtuse angle triangle. This height is same for this triangle. So this H cancel out, half cancel out, BD upon CD, which is X is to Y. So ratio of the base area of triangle is equal to the ratio of base. And we'll use this property to solve this question. Let us suppose area of triangle DEF is X. DEF is X and the ratio of CD and DE is equal to one is to one. Let us make some lines. Join A to D, B to E, and C to F. If the ratio is one is to one, and this area is X, therefore the area of CDF is also same. CD and DE is one is to one. So area of CD and DF is also one is to one. So area of triangle CDF is also X. So I'm writing here X. Now let us take triangle ADF. In this, there are two triangles. Area of triangle ADE upon area of triangle DEF. Now this will be equal to the ratio of their sides, base, AE and EF. And the ratio of A and F is 2 is to 1. Area of DF we have assumed as X. So area of triangle ADE will be twice X. Twice ADE. Two into X. So that is 2X. So this area is 2X. This particular property we will use in every triangle. If I take triangle ACE, then this CD and D are in the ratio of 1 is to 1. So we can say that area of ACD equals to area of ADE. And ADE is we have calculated 2x. So area of triangle ACD is also 2x. This is also 2x. Next, we will take triangle BDE. Triangle BDE. In triangle BDE, the ratio of DF and BF is 1 is to 3. It is given. BF and FD is 3 is to 1. So we can say that 
area of triangle BEF is equal to three times area of triangle DEF, the ratio of their base. And that is given as X. So BEF is 3X. In the same way, if I take triangle BCD, the ratio of CDF and CDF will be the ratio of DF and BF, which is 1 is to 3. Area of triangle CDF and area of triangle CBF is 1 is to 3, which is in the ratio of DF and BF. CDF is already given as X. So area of triangle CDF is 3X. This triangle is 3X. Only one triangle is left, which is AB. So in triangle ABF, A and AF, EF are in the ratio of 2 is to 1. Therefore, area of triangle ABE is equal to twice BEF because this line is 2 and 1. So this area will be double. This will be double of this. So area of triangle ABE is double of 3x. That is 6x. This area is 6x. Now we have written every triangle in the, in the form of X. So what is the total area of ABC? Area of triangle ABC is sum of all the triangles, area of all the triangles. So we have X two times, 2X two times, 3X two times, and one time 6X. X two times, 2 times 2x, 2 times 3x, and 1 times 6x. Let us add all these values. 1 plus 1, 2 plus 2, 4 plus 2, 6, and 6, 12, and 6, 18x. And we have to calculate the ratio of triangle DEF and ABC. So area of triangle DEF and ABC is x upon 18x, that is one ratio 18. So if this part DF is one part, then ABC, area of ABC is 18 part. I hope friends, you like this video. Please like our videos and subscribe to our channel.